I think a fantastic ingredient to use when you're cooking for a large number of people, which is incredibly straightforward but with fantastic results, is to cook a whole salmon. Now what I'm going to be doing is cooking this lovely salmon I've had from the fish counter. I've actually had the fish, but I'm going to take all the scales off. Unfortunately, this fish is too big for my oven. So what I'm going to do is take the head off. I'm actually just going to take these fins off using a pair of kitchen scissors. Now, to introduce those extra flavours to the salmon. Salmon has a fantastic flavour, but I want to enhance that, but not overpower it. I'm using some lovely fresh herbs, some parsley, some dill and some tarragon. So some of those into the cavity, and the rest I'm just going to lay on the foil under the fish. There we go. Some lemon. Again, just a couple of slices into the fish. Maybe two or three. The rest onto the foil. A few black peppercorns. Yeah, I'll just going to pop a couple of these in here. And a little bit of seasoning. Now there's one more trick actually to help give that salmon some structure. And instead of cooking on its side, I'm going to cook it sort of upright. So I've got some tin foil here which I've rolled almost into a kind of sausage shape. And one that's going to pack in all those flavours, but it's also going to make sure that the salmon kind of has a bit of structure as it cooks. It'll also make filleting it and taking it off the bone when it's cooked a great deal easier. Now. Stand that salmon up, make sure it's right on top of all of those herbs, that lemon, those peppercorns, and then start to wrap it up. Don't seal it just yet because I'm going to add some, some moisture by using some wine that'll actually help steam it, cook it, but also add another layer of flavour. Now in terms of preparation, that's it. So, get it onto my tray and into my preheated oven. You can already smell those fantastic herbs coming through from that salmon, the dill, the tarragon, the parsley. Now all I've got to do is very, very carefully unwrap that parcel. Sometimes the foil can stick to the skin, it hasn't in this case. And once I've opened that up, using a very sharp knife, is just start to scrape away that skin, leaving that beautiful, beautiful flesh. While the fish is still nice and warm, that skin's going to come away quite easily, but also try and scrape away some of this darker, dark flesh, which is the bloodline from the outside. And now for the really tricky bit. You spent so long cooking that fantastic salmon, it would be a real shame to break it. So being very careful, just lift it onto a fish slice or a spatula, or two, as I'm going to use. And there we go, an incredibly simple but effective way of cooking a fantastic salmon for a beautiful centerpiece for a celebratory lunch.